Hey guys, welcome back to another video here on Phoenix's Life with Marshall Smith Syndrome. Today is January 17th and we are here in Greenfield for um, at the orthopedics clinic at Children's for Phoenix's follow-up appointment with orthopedics. They're checking on her hips and her scoliosis, of course. So we just got here, um, we're supposed to be at 9.30 and it's nine o'clock, drove nonstop. Um, Phoenix did great, he's here, she's still, still back there. Hi, you woke up? She woke up finally. Said they are just checking on the hips and the scoliosis. I think more the scoliosis than the hips because um, our hips look great on the last two scans. So we'll go, we'll do an x-ray and then we'll see um we'll see the doctor and we'll see what they say what they think hopefully um i don't know what i'm hoping for i'm just hoping for the best always um try to get your hopes up but sometimes that doesn't help because then you feel disappointed when it doesn't work the way that you want it to so sometimes it's better to just go in there and just face whatever you get um so as you can see phoenix is wearing the upper brace um the body brace it's been pretty tough with that part because she is expected to go between the two braces between the upper brace and the body brace and the body brace with getting used to that one you're supposed to wear it like one hour and then take that off, put back on her upper brace. And I just didn't want to do have the um, aid at school to have to go through that. Um, so we would do that at home, the body brace at home, and then let her do um, the neck brace with her aid at school. So there's that. So I don't know what they're going to see on the scan. I don't know what the result is going to be. I am... It is going to be what it is. You got your brace? You ready to go see the doctor? I mean, we're early, so I'll probably just give her an opportunity to get something to eat. Because usually when we go on these drives, I don't feed her before we leave because she is prone to throwing up on drives. So usually I just wait until um, we get to our destination, then I'll feed her um or i just let her snack um and then when we get home i'll feed her to this is our only appointment today so this should be fun all right catch you in the next clip now we wait for extra years to get them on <laughs> What's your name? Blue? We call her Blue. <laughs> she upside down. Hold on. Oh my God. Hold on. Ow. It's coming. No. Yes. Bye, chair. Can I give you a chair a hug? Shoes? Oh, yeah, you're wearing your boots today. <laughs> they are nice boots, aren't they? Ooh. Look at it. 
I see it. Suction. Yeah. Again. Come on. Let's suction again. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. <laughs> really? Really? That is not a comfortable position. Want to suction? You have to come. The doctor is in the nurse's chair. So lower curve 85 without 39 with. Okay. That's and even the upper thing. 76 and Hi, so let's just sum up what happened at her appointment today. So um, the scan show, the x-rays show that the upper is 75 degrees of a curve and that the lower is 90 degrees of a curve. Um, so the 90 degrees is up from 85 or 83 the last time when they measured, when they did the x-ray. Um, so they said that that might just be, you know, the first x-ray she was laying down, the second x-ray she was standing up. So it might just be a difference in standing to laying down. Um, and then they also did an x-ray with her body brace on and that showed 
um, the 90 degree curved went down to 50 something degrees. So the upper curve stayed the same, which is expected because, you know, she doesn't have the upper part of it, part of her full brace as yet. She's still wearing them as two separate things. So, um, so that is good. That is good news that it, um, showed some improvement when she has the brace on so the uh, physician's assistant said that um, that is good because it shows that the the spine still has some flexibility in it which is what they want they want to know that the spine is still flexible and that it's not stuck you know in that position so again the bracing is literally just a delay um while they figure out what is the best approach for uh surgically fixing phoenix's um spine so that's both the lower spine where the scoliosis exists and the upper spine where the kyphosis exists um in february so this is january 19th a few days after that appointment so in February, she has the next appointment to get the rest of her brace finished up. And hopefully, um, pretty soon thereafter, they might have some answers as to what we should do next. So that is all the update there is on that. Um, kids are at school right now. I am getting ready for work. And yeah, that's about it gonna be a good day thank you so much for watching oh and i did make it home in time to pick up cj from school and take him to his swim practice he was extremely excited <laughs> Is that how excited you are to see me? <laughs> Alright, let's get dressed.